everybody, Anne here, Wellness Made Simple. If you don't know what you're looking at right here, it is the setup for making kombucha. Kombucha is fermented tea, fermented black tea usually, although you can use green. And the purpose of it is to, to promote and maintain healthy bacteria in your gut, which is really the key to your overall health and is also known as your second brain. So I'll just be showing you, I don't have time to do the whole process on this video, but I'll be telling you the basics of it and what you'll need as your setup. And then I'll also be including um, a link to a wonderful article about why kombucha is so good for you. So first of all, the basic thing that you have to have to make more kombucha is some kombucha in the first place. And you look at this and you say, what the heck is that? Now watch this. I hope you're not squeamish. This, my friends, is a SCOBY, S-C-O-B-Y. And a SCOBY is an acronym for a symbiotic colony of bacteria and yeast. Now, in this case, my SCOBY has several layers. So if anybody needs one, I can peel one off and um, give it to you so you can start your own kombucha journey. Anyway, a SCOBY, the purpose of it is to eat up the sugar when you're making your fermented tea and create a fermentation of the tea that is super, super good for making these beautiful um, probiotics that will help your gut to flourish. So what I'm going to do, because I want the SCOBY to stay moist while I'm making the tea, is going to put about a cup of the already made kombucha in there. And it'll just sit on there until I'm ready to make the next batch. So this is what it looks like. Isn't that lovely? You're saying, oh, I don't know about that stuff floating around. The stuff floating around is simply a little bit of the SCOBY that just came off because it's a living organism and, you know, just like things have roots and so forth, the SCOBY doesn't always stay in all in one piece. It's perfectly safe to drink it if you're drinking it um, in together with when you're drinking your kombucha. But if you want to strain it out, strain it out when you get ready to put it into bottles. These are great. I got them on Amazon and they're just so great. Reusable over and over and over again. 